this example, we've written down the reaction. You notice it's not completely balanced, but the question is which species in the reaction is the reducing agent and which is the oxidizing agent. So first we want to make sure we have the definitions of what this means to be an oxidizing and reducing agent. So I've written down a couple ways of defining oxidation or reduction. And so when we talk about, for example, an oxidizing agent, that means it oxidizes something. So something becomes oxidized. And so the oxidizing agent is reduced. And then likewise, for reduction, reduction agent is oxidized. In our reaction, silver goes from an oxidation state of zero to an oxidation state of plus one. So silver has lost electrons. So silver is oxidized. So that makes silver the reducing agent. And then NO3 is the oxidizing agent because it is reduced. So NO3 then is the oxidizing agent. Of course, once we decided silver is a reducing agent, then by default, NO3 must be the oxidizing agent.